got to yield to the technique. Not like strong man where you just beast it no matter what it takes. Like, you know, just pick it up. That's how Tom Mitchell used to train me. Yo, how do you flip a tire? Fucking flip it. <laughs> That's it. He didn't teach us no fucking technique, man. He was the greatest coach. He would just look at you and say, just, just get it going. Just pick it up. He's like, how's the form? You know, being a personal trainer and all that. I'm thinking about form, like, well, how should I be? He's just like, just pick the fucking thing up. <laughs> Put yourself in your place. Most people like to stay where they're comfortable. I like to go where I have to humble myself. Go get uncomfortable. Technique gets a little bit better, the aggression can come back. Yeah, when I went into straw man, I had no intention. I, was, I think it's probably the best, <laughs> the reason why I did so well, because I went in like, hey, this is just an experiment, just fucking around. Then I went and won, I was like, okay, I can win. Then I won again, I was like, you know, I can take the whole fucking thing. <laughs> so I gotta have the same fucking attitude. This is the way life always works for me. That's my back pocket, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna mouth it. Usually when I mouth things, I almost fuck them up. So I used to just said that, right? So what is this, 2000? All right, I might just put that in my pocket. I'm gonna be, act like no, but. I fucking love this shit too. I love lifting. I love strength. I love lifting. I love athletics. So yeah, maybe. I quit when I die. I'm like aggressive, so I, I attack that shit like, like I go hard on it. He was like, I've never seen a kid with that, with such strong lungs. But I was like, yeah, but I'm busy trying to knock people out. Sorry, bro. Pure aggression, that was always my skill. You wanna fuck shit up, boy? You know what feels good to me? Maybe somebody watching this can, can tell me why or correct me. I feel so much better when I start moving my feet like this or when I land like this. I get lower, I just feel, bro, when I was in college, I clean and jerked 315 at, at 18 years old, like this. I used to squat like that, everything with wide base. I got, a, I got a big hips and big ass and big muscles. They just, they, have, they get in my way. I can't stay here. I gotta get this shit out the way because my balls have room to be. Big balls.
drum Tony Robbins was with is the three S's. He calls, not described this in many different ways, but your state, your story, and your strategy. And those are the three things in that particular order. So if you work to maximize or, or make the way you approach them resourceful for your particular goals, you win at anything. You can affect your state by turning on music, by doing a lot of things like to talk about, bioenergetics, ah, it's getting crazy. And look, physically, your state, are balls. Really balls, it's your body, it's your instinct. How are you behaving? Your story, is kind of like your heart. It's basically how are you seducing yourself? What are you telling yourself in order to seduce yourself in a particular direction? State, story, strategy. Now what the fuck are you gonna do about it? You see? What are, you, what are you actually going to do? That's your strategy. Those three things, you can transform your life in any way you want. Powerful shit, head, heart, and balls.